<laughs> oh, that is a classic. Oh, I didn't see you over there. I was just enjoying a book from days long past. Welcome to my home. So you're here to learn about SiteWorks. Excellent. Well, I'm ready to introduce myself. My name is Jim, and I've been a developer at SiteWorks for almost a decade. A veteran, you might say, of this fine company. I've seen the ups and the downs and the comings and the goings of all sorts of people in this company. But through it all, I've been pretty happy at SiteWorks. I'm sure you're wondering, what would a gentleman such as myself be doing at a company like this for almost 10 years? Well, to help explain that, I'll need to take you back to the year 2007, to my first few days at the company. <clears throat> this is a story about Little Jim. Little Jim is fresh out of college and starting his career at SiteWorks as a junior developer. His first real job is an adult. He's been working with PHP along with HTML, CSS, and JavaScript throughout college and is ready to continue working with the same technologies he has become comfortable with over the years. He gets to work on his first day and is told, PHP, nope, learn this instead. Little Jim is devastated. Six years of knowledge and education being thrown away on his first day in the real world. Of course, he has quickly discovered that this wasn't the case at all. And after a few weeks and help from his coworkers, he picked up what was necessary and has been an asset to the company ever since. And they all lived happily ever after. You see, during my first few months here, I learned that SiteWorks needs its developers to be flexible. We don't always know what the next project will demand from us, but we'll always have to learn it and understand it in order to create a successful project. And nobody is expected to go at it alone. We're expected to work together and learn from each other to gain knowledge that leads us to more efficient production. Little Jim was able to ask his coworkers for help, and nobody ignored him. Nobody told him to just look it up. They helped him to the best of their abilities to make him a better developer. And in time, he did the same for others. Even with people coming and going, this culture has always persisted, and not only has it made the company better, but it's made working together much more enjoyable. That flexibility also applies to the type of projects we work on. During my time here, I've worked on a variety of clients in all types of industries. I've worked on public-facing informational websites, e-commerce sites, internal use sites, mobile apps, email templates, etc., etc. We need to adapt to our clients' needs to give them the best possible solution using the technologies allowed. Not everyone is always comfortable doing so. What it comes down to is that some people just don't want to learn new technologies. Some try but have a very hard time picking them up. And this is what has led me to see a lot of people leave since I started here. But sticking with only one thing and using it for a long time, or even forever, does not sound like an exciting job for me. It doesn't even sound like a job I'd like. I want to learn something new every other project. I want to be challenged. And I want to help my coworkers to excel and not feel like I'm in competition with them all the time. And I have all that here at SiteWorks. And that's why I don't want to be anywhere else. Well, would you look at the time? We've been having so much fun that I swear only a few minutes had passed. Well, thank you for coming and I hope I was able to help you to understand what makes SiteWorks so great. Goodbye. Oh, it gets me every time. <laughs> this concludes our fireside chat with Jim, presented by SiteWorks.